Tight to me um, is fun, it's welcoming, it's colourful, because <laughs> there's colours everywhere. Um, and it's all, it's like, it's a gathering, it's, you know, there's support there, it's all about, you know, being equal, being accepted, so it's, there's, I could go on and on and on, but, you know, to me, you know, it's, it's really, it means quite a lot to me, yeah. Pride means to me a way of the LGBT community to kind of um, show like how much we need, we want equal rights as well as everyone else and it's a kind of history thing that we do. I see it as a point as a communal event, like with people, gay people and lesbian, bisexual and transgender people of Edinburgh can come together and just basically get their voices heard. Just to celebrate who I am, individuality, and because it's a really good experience, good atmosphere. <laughs> I think for me to get involved with the Pride planning team, it was all about um, kind of getting my voice, getting your voice out there, kind of getting that experience in the planning side. Because I've been at Pride, I think what two or three times now. I think it's more just me. They've given something to me, so I'm giving something back. That's how I kind of got involved. It's just kind of been one of these things that I quite like to take part in. I um, performed last year, which I thought was really fun. It was getting my first performance. So I thought I should give a little something back and start it. I think this year the Pride Youth team is, uh, I feel the most involved uh, that it's been um, in terms of the strategies I've adopted to keep people's interest, you know, with, in the whole process, to keep people sustained throughout the eight weeks we've been doing it, um, to have a mix of agenda and a progressive agenda every week so we're getting somewhere. Um, so, yeah, I suppose in the planning and to make it sure it's sustained through the, until the actual day has been a, you know, an achievement this year. This is straight from the heart. From the top of the world Feel the love tonight Let the music play Let's go, let's go I've got a feeling It's going down tonight So let's get moving Turn up the music Turn on the party lights Baby, can you take it? Can you take the heat off the floor? I'm Alison Stewart and welcome to the Pride School Show LGBT Youth Space at Appleton Towers in Edinburgh. What are your um, overall thoughts of today's turnout? It's been amazing. Really, really good. What stood out for you the most today? Um, I think the turnout at the march and how many young people are here, it's been really beautiful. Uh, you enjoyed yourself so far? Yeah, it's been brilliant. It's just been really great to put that together. So we're looking forward to uh, more Pride Games later on. Yes. Yes. Oh, I've sorted all of them and all the rules in the put that in the bag. Yeah, what do you make of these ones? Yeah, they're fine. Yeah, been a bit busy.
pride and all, and I'm really enjoying myself, as you can see by the face paint. <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving it. It's been a good vibe, so yeah. Mm. Anything that stood out for you? Um, the massaging and the face painting. I thought that was really good. Having a wonderful time. I really love the live music actually because I think it's really nice to see uh, people who maybe come into groups and weren't that confident actually and over time you know they're now standing in front of you know a good number of folks singing. been really good, yeah, there was a, a lot of young people came after the march, people seem to have enjoyed it, new people as well, um, so yeah, it's been really good, it's been a good space as well. The drums, like, didn't they add it so much to the parade? You felt powerful, the drums were cool. And the amount of like, consideration that people took in just to join together to get into one cause. Nice to be here for some of the new people that worked with some of their first prides, so that's been really nice to see this. I am so much looking forward to the Pride Games later yeah, on this um, I might, I mean I might I might also have to make smoothies because that's my official job but I'm, I'm up for some uh, Pride Game activities. We're not in the old times anymore, um, being gay and stuff so more acceptable so we should, well we are human, we're exactly the same as straight people just we just love who we love.